Hey there everyone and welcome to War for the Overworld. This is the first episode in a series of random games. Um, I've decided I just want to try out, play some of my favorite games and some brand new games from my collection, which is, you know, growing rapidly. And I thought what better place to start than a spiritual remake of one of my favorite games from way back when, um, namely uh, Dungeon Keeper. Um, it was a superb game where you build a dungeon uh, to defend against waves of of heroes coming to, uh, well, defeat you as the Lord of the Underworld. So, um, we're just going to play a quick game, maybe the tutorial, and see how the beta is coming along. This is extremely early beta, so I haven't even looked at this yet, so bear with me as I learn how to play, but that's one reason why... Um, Playing the beta, or sorry, the tutorial, such as it is, would be a good place to start on a beta. Darkest greetings, Underlord. Welcome to the realm of Keros. I see you are a bit unfamiliar with your powers. Fortunately for you, I'm well versed in Underlord, and will gladly teach you all that is necessary for you to conquer the goodly heroes of this realm as well as any Underlord who dares stand in your path. Let's start by excavating the space around your dungeon. Ah, oh, yes. Left click on the tiles to tag them, and your workers will swiftly act upon your will. Congratulations, Underlord. It's a very familiar interface. The very earth quakes in fear of your unholy aptitude. I don't have while your workers heed your yet. command. Let us look upon the rooms already present within your dungeon. Hmm. The lair. Within the cozy walls of this room, your minions will lay their wicked, weary heads to rest and restore their vitality. Gold is required to pay for rooms, traps, and the wages of your minions. Hmm. Keep the coffers of your vault full and your dungeon will hum with productivity. The dungeon core is your tether to this realm. If destroyed, you will be banished to the ether, putting a swift end to your war for the overworld. Your workers have finished excavating and claiming the area you tagged. You may now build rooms and defenses upon the claimed tiles. Within the slaughter pen, creeps the succulent micro piglet, a necessary staple to keep your minions well fed. Huh. This is... Build one now by selecting it and dragging across the empty room. Deliciously done, Underlord. In order for minions to enter your dungeon, you will need to claim the nearby gateway. Cool. This is like an old splendidly done, old Underlord. <laughs> Controlling gateways will allow new minions to enter this realm and join your dungeon, where they will heed your malicious command. Open now the veins of evil. Here you can gain access to new defenses, spells. Rooms and rituals. Archive unlocked. The archive will attract the cunning cultist to your cause. You will need at least a 3x3 three three area for them to study ancient texts, hmm. which will increase the speed at which you earn. This is. This is really cool, because this is exactly like. A familiar old game I've played in the past. It's Dungeon Keeper, just beautifully done. War for the Overworld. This is cool. I can't afford to. I don't. Oh, no. Alright, we're in. Interesting. Okay. It's not until they've built the floors to make it all nice. Oh. A cultist has entered your dungeon. He will use his blasphemous knowledge...
to obliterate your enemies in battle. Open now the veins of evil. Cool. What do we have here? Before I do that, I want to have a closer look at this. Because this is really beautifully done. I wish I could kill this. I guess this is a classic isometric game. There must be a way to rotate your view here. But it's possible... Oh! Hold on, what did I do? Okay, pressing one takes me to... Pressing the number one takes me here. I'm doing this so blind, it's hilarious. Huh. Alright. So what were we... Ah, oh, yes, the veins of evil. Let's see what they want me to build now. Learning, learning, learning. Foundry unlocked. The Foundry will attract the repugnant Chanda to your cause. Okay. You will so need at least all a three basic by three area for them to create defenses for your dungeon. Cool. So these are just the basic guides you can bring to the dungeon right now. This is pretty nicely done. Have to say. So I kicked this last year, and this is the first time I've actually looked at the, uh... The Chunder is capable Whoa. of delivering near-fatal fits of flatulence on demand. And for this reason, many of your minions take their bacon to go. The hammer on its head is as hardened as its stomach lining, which makes it well-suited for work in the foundry. Huh. Okay, then. Command your Chunder to build a door by placing its blueprint near your dungeon core. Cool. Your chunder has built a door. See how your workers act quickly to deliver and unpack it. A door will stop roving enemies for a short time, granting hmm. you precious moments to call your minions to defend your dungeon from invasion. Oh, it's been rotated. Nice. It's rotating as it sees fit. Uh-oh. I hope I didn't hit the wrong button. A gaggle of hairy, drunken midgets are assaulting your dungeon. <laughs> Let us put your minions to the test of battle. Oh, dear. See how the shield above your enemies weakens. Once defeated, they will fall and conquer. Hairy, drunken min midgets. <laughs> you have defeated the weak invaders. That. Pretty fun. Whoops. Uh oh, where are we going? And what have we found? Oh. Back thee away, Underlord. You shall not defile my lands with your vile taint. My righteous hand shall stay your evil ways and send you back to whence you came. Lovely. Yada yada yada. <laughs> what a pathetic exactly. speech. I suggest you punish this insolent lord of feeling. Hmm. That's really funny. Hmm. A chanda has entered your dungeon. Cool. You've received a new skin. Got here. Vault room. Summon worker spell. The minions of evil invade! To arms! Fight for the glory of the Empire! The time has come to strike. Command your troops with rally to silence the arrogant Lord of Sealand. Rally. Let's see. Ah, oh, here we are. Okay. Cool. So that just has everybody Fire go. Upon this and devilry. this must be a way of getting specific groups to go where you want them to go. Useful. Two arms! Oh, well, let's hope these guys aren't too strong. A pox on your evil ways! Oh my god. 
fie upon this devilry. Oh, yeah. Well, that didn't work out so well for you, did it? Beckons. All right. Well done, Underlord. If you desire a greater challenge, you can hmm. continue your campaign and return to fight the Underlord Rascos. I bid you sinister farewell. Until hmm. next time, Underlord. Interesting. Just a nice little... Just a nice little tutorial. It's pretty straightforward. Interesting. Huh. Actually kind of shorter than I would have liked, but I guess I didn't have to go and attack him like that right away. Well, let's go, uh... Check this one out. Uh, Brasco's Domain. So, still a work in progress. Um, you know, not a... You know, it's still a beta. It's in the Bedrock beta. It's, uh... I don't know exactly when the intended final release date is, but the these last days... The Underlord was barely a morsel. I trust you'll make a fine meal for me and my minions. <laughs> oh, shush you. All right. Underlord Raskos lurks nearby. To limit your competition, I suggest you vanquish him before he poses a threat to your <laughs> campaign. Indeed. Choose right. one of three aspects within the veins of evil to begin building your dungeon. I... The Archive will grant you cultists and hasten your ability to unlock new aspects within the veins of evil. Okay. The Foundry will bring Chanders to your cause and grant you the ability to build defenses for your dungeon. All right. The Beast Den will bring bloodthirsty beasts to your dungeon hmm. in droves, allowing you to begin a swift assault upon your family. Let's go with the cultists. Archive unlocked. Hmm. You have discovered a perception shrine. Interesting. The perception shrine will remove fog of war over a large radius allowing you to react swiftly to enemy movement. Oh, cool. You have discovered a perception shrine. Yes, I believe you mentioned that already. All right, why do I not get control over this yet? Interesting. It's... It worked just fine in the last one. All right. Apparently, there's something not working quite right. I'm not able to move around right now. All right. Oh, no, continue. Hmm. It's not going to work very well if I can't move, I tell you that. This is going to let me do anything. Has been researched. Unless there's something more I'm supposed to do to get ready for this. Vault unlocked. Interesting. Interesting. Summon worker and credit. Yeah, Beast look at that as well. unlocked. Interesting. Okay, so it's how much much I've got here. Foundry unlocked. And let's grab Ballista Defense as well, and that should do that. Hmm. Oh, interesting. Alright, so nothing seems to be allowing me to move around, so something has probably gotten stuck. So give me a second here, and I'll be right back. It is a beta after all, right? And welcome back. I guess when you switch maps in the beta right now, uh, sometimes it locks your keyboard. Anyways, no big deal. Started afresh, didn't lose that much anyways. Let's pick up where we were going to leave off here. And let's get some, uh, some uh, resources here. Let's see what we can get. All that gold. A new scene has been researched. Okay. There we are. Alright, let's see 
we can do here. We're attempting to get some space for cultists and for our... Oh, and, oh, there's another perception shrine right there. Okay, that's interesting. And there's our enemy underlord and his minions. All right, well, let's uh, start with the shrine room. I'm guessing I can't build quite yet. Because I don't quite have room for it. Soon, though. Come on, you little minions. Alright, let's make that my cultist space. some of that. I wonder if there's a way of building walls. Hmm. Oh well. A cultist has had to do that. And a chunder. Let's see. What else do we need here? So we've got spells. A chunder has do? entered your dungeon. In pass. That's the rally. And that's the trap. Ballista defense. Okay. Just, uh... Actually, let's go this way. And yeah, this will be a defensive space. I love the windy rooms, right? has been researched. Hmm. Cool. Alright, what do we have here? Doors? Wooden door defense. Rampart defense. Bone chiller. Chill spell. Ooh, lightning. Lightning I like, unlocked. I like lightning. Lightning school. Oops. Well, that's unfortunate. Quite enough room to cut it the way I was hoping, but that's all right. Very interesting indeed. So that's the impassable stone, which is traditional. Let's uh, see, what can we build? Mm, okay, so doors. Wooden door. Unlocked. Okay, let's get some wooden doors in place here. So. And it'll be interesting to A see. defense has been built. Exactly what it takes. Can't help it. Look at all that pretty gold. And we'll see what lightning defense looks like. Or is that something I use? Hmm. You've received a new sin. How does that work, I wonder? Interesting. Maybe I have to use it on a minion or something. Poor little minions. <laughs> a cultist has entered your dungeon. We should build research and grab the beast chamber, because I'm sure a few beasts will be fun to have. Beast den unlocked. And let's see, where can we put a beast den? I'll assume a 3x3 three three will be adequate for this. A gnarling has entered your dungeon. Okay. Actually, let's... A chanda has entered your dungeon. Cool. Ah, oh, let's see. I may not have left myself enough room to operate here. Or at least not to put a 
beast den in a reasonably sensible place. So we'll put it right there and hope for the best. And then we'll put a ballista. Let's see what it looks like. I also don't know if these are passable or not, or how they how they work on that front. So that'll be interesting to see. And he's gonna run and get a, something from the Chunders and run back to build it. That's what I thought we were supposed to do. The defense has been built. Whoa, that's kind of wrong. Cool, but wrong. A battle has entered your dungeon. All right. A scarg has entered your dungeon. Mm, we got critters coming in. A cultist has entered your dungeon. We should make a bigger treasure room. It looks a little crowded in there, doesn't it? Oh, fill those spaces in there. That is a lot of gold. A chamber has entered your dungeon. Okay. Looks... A gnarling has entered your dungeon. Well, I guess we could go out here and start conquering this outside area and see what happens. I mean, the worst that could happen is I, I lose the first time playing this game, right? A cultist has entered your dungeon. Let's see what we got here. Foundry room. Slaughter pen. I would assume we don't have the vault. There we are. Vault, vault room. unlocked. Gotta, gotta have room for the spoils, right? Now we're talking. Ooh. Dragon thing. A chanda has entered your dungeon. I should I should summon some more minions. Or I should get the spell to summon more minions. Because I think that's what those guys who are building are. A nodding has entered your dungeon. There we are. Okay, so that's how you get more workers. And that's... You have claimed the perception tribe. This is my mana bar. Use the bones of your soul to pick your minions' flesh from my teeth. Oh, really? You think so, do you? I think you're just full of it. But just in case you're not, we'll add a few things here. Like that. And that. And right here looks like an excellent spot for a ballista or two. A defense. Go. A new sin has been researched. This is pretty sweet. Ooh, portal. A uh, portal for monsters. And my minions can walk across this level, this layer of water, which is good to know. Capture me. Another perception orb. It's a useful way for expanding my view of the uh, region. Oh, hello. You have claimed the perception shrine. Indeed, and I've probably it made him seems mad. Seems there is an unguarded entrance to Raskos's dungeon. Excellent. Capitalize quickly, Underlord, for he will surely defend it soon. All right. Well, I'm not in a huge hurry, so we'll see what happens. Let's see if there's a. A Bafu has entered your dungeon. Let's see if I can hit any of his. There we are. Let's go there. A star has entered your dungeon. Let's see what else we got here. A chamber has entered your dungeon. I guess we'll see what happens. A cultist has entered your dungeon. I guess I can make... A gnarling has entered your dungeon. I've got a lot of monsters in here now, don't I? 
That's cool. I wonder if I made the rooms bigger if more monsters would show up. A defense has been built. Well, shall we crack it open? See what's inside? And we'll bring over a few uh, ballista here. Here we go. It's party time. A cultist has entered your dungeon. Get him, boys. See what these guys can, what all these monsters of mine can do. We've got all sorts of fun critters here. Also have magic that I've never gotten to try. Ha 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 ha! I'm liking this. A defense. Nice. Lovely. <laughs> Your pathetic minions can't save you. Like a maggot, I will wait in the ether for you, oh. ready to infest and consume your rotting soul. Okay, dramatic much? Like seriously. You are a marvelous underlord. I hope you come back to continue your war for the overworld. Hmm. Interesting. Well, that was a good little first look. Um, I think the, the two, those two missions were a little shorter than I would have liked, but it certainly gave me sort of a taste of the game. I'm really looking forward to this one being finished, because I think this, I, I, hope, I hope the story mode is as fun and more challenging than it is right now. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. Hope you had fun, and I will see you in the next episode of whatever I happen to be playing next time. <laughs>